Hello guys, welcome to the next video tutorial on Android app development for beginners. In this video, we will see how to create a new activity and open it using our main activity or first activity. So for example, for some reason you want to open a new activity or the next activity using your first activity. How we can do it, we will see in this video. So right now I have uh, this blank project or you can say hello world project and if you don't know how to create this project you can just go to uh, the initial videos of this series and see how I've, I have created this blank project. So this uh, project uh, right now have only one activity which is our main activity right. Now to add a new activity to your um, app what you need to do is go to your app here so just select Android and in here in the app category you just need to go to this uh, res or res folder and res stand for resources folder and inside this res resources folder there is a folder called layout right you just need to right click on this layout folder and go to new and we are going to go to the activity and we will select a blank activity from here. So select the, this blank activity and in here this uh, wizard will open. You can give a name to your activity for example second activity okay and everything is uh, by default uh, created for you and just click finish. Once you uh, click finish, there will be a second activity which will be created for you. And now you will be able to see in, in your layout folder in your resources uh, directory, there will be a extra XML file created for your second activity which is activity underscore second dot XML. Similarly, in your Java, Java folder, you will be able to see that there will be a new class added to your uh, Java folder which is second activity dot Java file and in the manifest folder here there will be a file called android manifest dot xml file and in here also you will be able to see that um, uh, this new activity is added to your uh, to your uh, you know main manifest xml file right now what we are going to do is we are going to uh, add in this manifest file where uh, your uh, main activity uh, xml uh, element is there and now you have this uh, second activity uh, tag right so by default it's a uh, blank uh, tag in a sense that it just have uh, the name and the title but uh, unlike this uh, main activity it doesn't have this intent filter tag so we what we are going to do is we are going to copy uh, this uh, intent filter from here so just copy this and go inside your second activity element or tag here and just make a space here and paste this intent minus filter here right and in here what you need to do is you need to change uh, this name in the action and the category so the in the category first in the category uh, tag you just need to change it to the default because the launcher of our app is the main activity which is this one and the second activity is the default activity so just delete this launcher from here and just do dot default okay and similarly this name should be the name of your uh, uh, package okay so just go to your uh, 
activity underscore second dot XML file inside your layout folder. So just go here and go to the text of this uh, folder. So this is my activity underscore second dot XML file. And in here you will be able to see uh, tools uh, colon context is equal to com dot example dot whatever your package name is, right? You just need to copy this uh, path from here, which start from com dot uh, example or whatever your package name is. Just copy this path and once again go to your Android manifest dot XML file. And instead of this and Android dot intent dot uh, whatever dot main in your action uh, tag, you just need to replace it by your second activity package name, which is com dot uh, example dot whatever your package is. Okay. So this uh, will be similar to this thing. Okay. So second activity, second activity. Okay. Now everything is done. Now we are ready to, uh, you know, create some code to open the second activity from our first activity. So I'm going to open my first activity first. And in here, in the main activity, what I'm going to do is I will just remove everything. And in here, I'm going to add a button. And this button I'm going to use to open my second activity. So I will just change the text to open second activity, for example. Okay. And the ID I will leave it as default, which is button. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my main activity dot Java file here. So this is the Java file for my main activity. And in here, I'm going to cast this button. So first I will create a button instance. So private static button, for example, I name my, uh, variable as button submit. And now what I'm going to do is in here, just below my on create method, I'm going to create a new method as I have been doing in the last videos, which is a public void. And uh, for example, this method, I name it as on click button listener. Okay. It's not going to take any uh, argument. And now we will write the code of uh, this method. Okay. So first thing first, first of all, we are going to cast this button to its ID. So button SBM is equal to button and I will find it by ID. So find view by ID R dot ID dot button, which is the ID of my button. And now I'm going to take my button underscore SBM variable and I will add or set a listener to this uh, button variable. So dot set on click listener and inside this uh, set on click listener i will create a new on click listener so new on click listener right so this is simple right and inside this on click method we are going to create a object of a intent class so this is the class which we uh, which will help us to open the new activity, which is our second activity. So let's create an object of intent, 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 for example, variable name is intent is equal to new intent. And the constructor of this intent takes a uh, argument, which is the package name of your second activity or whatever activity you want to open. 
so as you remember that we have changed the name of uh, this uh, action tag here which was this one so I'm going to copy this uh, path from here com dot example dot whatever uh, and at the last your activity a uh, name comes so in here I will copy this path from here and I'm going to go to my main activity and as an argument of this intent uh, constructor I'm going to pass it here okay so now everything is done now I just need to uh, call this intent to start the activity so there is a method called start activity which takes intent uh, as an argument okay so in the start activity just pass your intent uh, variable and now everything is done now we just need to call this uh, method inside our on create method so just copy the name of this method and just call it inside our main method and now we are going to run our application so now our activity is uh, running now which is our main activity I will click this open second activity button and once we click this our second activity opens by this button we can go back to our first activity and once again when we click our uh, button it opens our second activity right hello world okay so in this way you can open your second activity using your first activity uh, by using this intent uh, method so intent class so i hope you have enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye